It was a traumatic event for both of us. So the lesson is, turn the lights on, turn the lights on, turn the lights on. I can't believe this happened to me and to Charlie. This morning at 4 a.m., Charlie wakes me up. He's got to go. He's got to go. He's got to go. I open the door. I don't even have time to throw on anything warm. And I step out on the deck. I don't turn the lights on. Nothing. I just let him go because he's got to go. And he knows where I know where he's going. He runs up to his spot. And then I wait. What seems like an eternity, I just think I'm starting to think maybe I should go in and grab a light. And then I hear a blood curdling scream. I see Charlie's white chest in the moonlight basically coming after me. And right behind him is this white blob. And Charlie is, I've never seen him run so fast. He's a pretty fast runner. And I'm standing on the steps of the house and right behind Charlie on his literally inches from his tail to the coyote. Oh no! And Charlie screamed and took off and the coyote was in pursuit right behind him. What's the lesson here? <laughs> Always turn lights on when you live in the country and you go outside in the dark at any time of year. And in fall, they're starting to move because it's cool now, so they're not so slow anymore. Turn the lights on. Don't worry who might be disturbed by the brightness. Just turn the lights on, grab a flashlight and <laughs> grab something warm to put on just in case. But had the lights been on, the coyote would never have come out of the bush. He thought it was perfectly dark and Charlie was up there all by himself. Coyotes perform that way. Recon guy coming out to check it out. Boom, they're opportunists. Here's a nice fat morsel. Right, Charlie Brown? You wouldn't have let him go, would you? You wouldn't have let, you wouldn't have let that go. You'd be tasty. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, it was a traumatic event for both of us. So the lesson is, turn the lights on, turn the lights on, turn the lights on when you go outside in the dark, even if you're in the city, because coyotes right now are everywhere. Reminds me of the Lion King when the jackals take over. I'm Karen Laws, the Ontario dog trainer, living in the country, turning on the lights from now on. Thanks for watching.